Welcome back to Good Day Atlanta. It's 943 and nothing says I love you quite like a romantic dinner on Valentine's Day, whether at a great restaurant or in your own kitchen. Executive Chef Rodney Ashley and sous chef Mark Ludy from Chateau Elan are here with how to make crab cakes. Hello to Hello, both. Oh, I you? like that too. It's Valentine's Very Day. Very nice. Yeah, it's probably one of the busiest days for restaurant it uh, is. workers. It definitely <laughs> is. Uh, couples love to go out and uh, we love to wow them. Sure. Yeah. Okay, so obviously Chateau Alain known for many things, one of them being the incredible food. So are these crab cakes something on the menu? They are. They will be featured on our uh, Valentine's Day prefixed menu. Mm -hmm. uh, comes with uh, Oysters Casino. So uh, they're uh, cold smoked, applewood smoked oysters. And we have a surf and turf. We have all sorts of goodies. Very, very nice. Okay, so you're going to be walking us through how to make these crab cakes at home if it's something that we're brave enough to try. Yes. And, and Chef Mark down there is, is getting us started with that. So what did you do first? Well, first what we're going to do, I'll show you how to make these quick. Uh, when you're making crab cakes, I always like to add all of the dry ingredients first. Mm -hmm. uh, so we'll do some peppers. We'll do some capers. Okay. Uh, I like red onion or Vidalia onion since we're in Georgia. <laughs> no, always appropriate. To. Yes. Yeah. What is that? Little breadcrumbs. Okay. Breadcrumbs uh, is going to help the crab bind together so that it will not fall apart. Mm -hmm. A little bit of egg. Okay. That will help bind. So this is going to be very, lots of textures. Lots on. of textures. Yeah. Lots of. Um, it takes you on a little roller coaster ride, basically. Mm -hmm. And then. A little Duke's mayonnaise is my favorite. <laughs> okay. So this will be on our menu. There's a good stuff. There In we go. In Versailles. Uh huh. Um, it's probably pretty popular too. It is. Yeah, a lot of people appreciate some good crab cakes. You can come to Chateau Elan. Uh, it's a great. It's not far too far for a vacation where you have to get on a plane, uh, but you can. It's a great destination from Atlanta where you can just hop in your get car, away. get away, yeah. and um, and you're just right there. We have several different restaurants on property. Okay. So basically, what you want to do is mix everything together, let it set, let the breadcrumbs kind of absorb everything, and then at that point you can form a nice little crab cake. Mm -hmm. Okay, so walk me through what's happening down on the other end. Down on the other end, Mark is searing them. I like to use a, a whole butter because then you get a nice little caramelization going on. It's rich. Um, there's nothing like butter. <laughs> butter. I think we can we can second you on that. Butter and crab. Yes. Is what's going on. Good so with these oysters, what I like to do is I have this smoking gun. Yeah. What? It, explain this to me. What's? So basically, you can smoke the oysters without cooking them. Uh -huh. So you're going to get that nice smoky flavor without them oh, without them being cooked. So that's how you do that. Mm -hmm. So what do we do at home though if we don't have one of those? <laughs> well, one you of can those get in my one kitchen. of these. Yeah, you can buy these. Um, I got this one on Amazon. You just plug in uh, smoking gun. Okay. And, and it'll <laughs> That's what's going to come up. <laughs> okay, so how go. long how long does does this need to I will let this sit for about 20 minutes. Mm -hmm. The longer you let it sit, the more it will go. Sometimes okay. I don't like it to be too offensive. Right. On the smoke. Okay. Okay. Now I think a lot of people, including myself, would be intimidated to try to do oysters at home. So you're saying it is possible mm -hmm. to and do this yourself? Yes, you can. Um, there's all sorts of uh, different grocery stores that you could buy them in. Uh, these are uh, Virginica oysters, so they're local. Mm -hmm. uh, I I think Virginia is still local. It's just <laughs> off the road. It is. Yeah. We'll we'll let you play mm -hmm. that. Uh, also. Crab cakes are featured in um, our spa restaurant, Flor de Lis. Mm -hmm. So you could, uh, the couples can come down and get a uh, couple's massage at the spa. Uh, and then after you're nice and relaxed, you can come and have a crab cake. Very nice. That yeah. sounds like a wonderful, wonderful getaway right there. And how mm -hmm. long will those oysters need to? Not to long at there? all. You know, you can cook them for probably 30 seconds, a minute. Mm -hmm. If you're uh, less venturous, you can cook them a little bit longer. Um, so at this point, we're going to top these uh, oysters off. Typically an oysters casino is served in the shell mm -hmm. uh, and it's topped with uh, bacon, peppers, onions. I have a little bit of a Gruyere cheese on there Ooh, and we'll actually good. serve it on a toasted brioche. A Yum. little toasted brioche so you can pop the whole thing instead of 
having to toss right. the shell. Right. I like that. I like that. Makes it a, a little bit cleaner. Your your enjoyable experience exactly. might, be, might be slightly higher. Now we are out of time, unfortunately, but there you go. You can do this at home. If you want to give it a shot, you can go to fox5atlanta.com. Just look for the viewer information story and the details of this will be right there for you. So I want to thank you both so much for coming in today. Thank you. And I brought Appreciate you something. It. Here's your little Valentine gift. Oh, thank you so much. I appreciate it. You just made my day. <laughs> <laughs> I love it. Well, coming up next.